But we can be okay. fucked up. We can talk about how fucked up shit is. I don't know. You tell me how fucked up it's fucked up. It's fucked up. That's fucked up. Nah, that's fucked up. Nah. I can't. I can't. Nah, that's it's fucked in. up. I'm your host, Haley, joined by Vance Michelle. On today's episode of How Fucked Up is Fucked Up, we take a look at an inventor and his inventions that are so fucked up, it's unfucking believable. It's crazy. Unfucking believable. This brings us to Hugo Gernsback. He's a okay. famous and infamous American Luxembourgish. So Luxembourg, he's from Luxembourg, born in Luxembourg, moved to America. He was an inventor, a writer, an editor, and a magazine publisher. He had too many jobs, man. What's he doing, son? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he was born in 1884. She must have had like three wives to, for him to do all them jobs. Actually. He had yeah, a couple exactly. wives. You see, I know. Not it. at one I know time, it. I don't think there was like two divorces. Exactly. Ah, see, I know it. Son had to keep his bread up. Yeah. I was like, for him to have that many jobs, this motherfucker dealing with too much drama on the side. <laughs> That's so, the answer. Luxembourg, because he moved to America where he got all his fame, right? And then in 1954, he was actually awarded the Luxembourg's Order of the Oak Crown. That's like getting knighted in Luxembourg. So everyone was like, yo, this guy is hot shit. They even made right. Hugo Awards for him, because they know his name, Hugo's. And that was an achievement award presented at World Science Convention. Okay. So, he was really cool in Luxembourg, but then like back here, he got some stank to his name because he was like this huge magazine producer and like he would not pay his writers. Get he his money, nice. gotta get his money, gotta yeah. get his money. Back had 80 patents by the time he died. He died at 83 years old. So 80 patents? 80 patents. But I mean, like that doesn't mean he made all of the patents. It just means he designed them and they would have been sound designs, like things that would actually work. But like 1900s is where all of this crazy technology started. Mm. 1913 was the first patent design for headphones. Oh yeah. But before that, Gernsback actually invented on the phone. He invented an earpiece that would like cancel out noise because it just like hated distraction. He hated it. Mm. So like this little earpiece, which is kind of like what the head was like, very like sucks into our ears, so we don't hear anything. Yeah people create the same ideas and even so Gernsback created the earpiece Nathaniel created the earphone and then in 1917 this guy Gernsback he was probably pissed off at Nathaniel so he was like fuck you I'm gonna make a better earphone so he actually redesigned an earphone set ah, you know, they, yeah they right? changed it a bit you gotta, so. you gotta add colors and shit I can call from like I feel like I'm, I'm one with Siri with these mm -hmm. hey Siri text back Hey, I thought it was fire too, my boy. Hey, yo, I'm texting with Siri right now, and this shit is litty. I'd like to look at some of these inventions. The first one is the electric hairbrush. Ew, this shit look like a hot comb. Yo, but it doesn't get hot. It just, I like, in the way, like, we can't see how it works, right? So the idea is it's supposed to brush, but may also be used as a massaging instrument. What? So I'm not sure if it shakes. <laughs> it looks stupid. Somebody gets shocked the fuck up using that shit. Yeah. What are you yeah. talking about? Have you ever seen Modern Family? Because that's my favorite. He actually made a head scratcher, which it's like a stupid thing, but it's a helmet and it has a bunch of little like noggenizers. I'm watching the electric brush still. Yeah. See, I think I seen one of these in my house one time. Really? It's not even a joke. Yeah. Damn. Why Why would it be an electric brush? Like, would they do they even work better than a regular brush? I don't understand. What's the I don't point? even think, how is it going to brush your hair if it's banging off your scalp? Yeah. <laughs> well, you're going to yeah. love the next one. What's um, the next one? The next one was designed by him in 1963, so actually closer to the end of his life. These were called teleglasses. They're like the VR glasses. You know those things that we have and that everyone's wearing now? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, uh, dreamt up 3D TV specs. Oh, shit. You this see Gerd's back wearing it with his little black yeah. and white and his bow tie. He's so cute. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen him. My man's the one who invented VR, VR goggles and shit. Pretty much. He thought of it first. 
he was someone he was who so really needed it like right in front or like really in their their you know in their space because like i yeah. guess he was distracted easy yo the tv glasses is, is ill matter of fact i like the way how he had it tenor, but this boy looked like i'd be crazy if we still to had these like to walk around with this shit. but because of this guy it's like now people could watch vr porn and then and 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 it's because of green's back gern's back gern's back, gern's back. <laughs> That's Gernsback. Gernsback is the reason why this Pornhub VR, man. Like, yo. Respect in another guy I could give respect to like this, but Gernsback said, dude. Like, like, like for a lot of dudes, like, yo, he's responsible for a lot of dudes kind of um recreation and shit. What's the next shit? You want the next shit? The next shit? Okay. Yeah. What's the next shit? This is my favorite invention that we have yet to see, and it's not been reinvented yet. So it's nothing close to being reinvented. Um, okay. And if you were to ask me how fucked up is fucked up, uh -huh. this is fucked up, okay? This is fucked up? This is fucked up. Uh, mostly the reason that we're in 2020, and who, who knows, like something similar like this might come out, but this is called the isolator. Sounds like a fucking jail or some shit. Sounds like a yeah. chamber. Sounds like a chamber. It sounds like a room I don't want to be in. What? Oh my God. Now Hold let up. me give you a little bit nah, of Nah, wait. It shit looked like laundry machines. Hold up, y'all. Hold up. This ain't not. Nah. It looked like the um like the 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 fucking man in the iron mask mask, man. Yeah. You ever no, seen man in the iron mask? It's like Iron Man? You never heard this? This is a three month. Matter of fact, this is the story of the three months it is. It's like the I biggest like story. I feel like I've seen it when I was really this young. I'm, yeah, I Leo. It now. It's, it's Leo. It's my Leo, baby. exactly. Exactly. It's a movie. Leo. But yeah, this guy makes me look like, he look like, don't, don't you see the mask in that movie in this? Don't it kind of look similar? Yeah, it does. A little bit. Okay, well, don't let say, me tell you the yeah, reason the for this, this machine. Go? Why? This was this was designed because people were distracted. He, he was thought people were distracted too easily and it was too hard to focus on the task at hand. First, it wasn't connected to an oxygen tank. It was just a metal box with goggles. Now these goggles are fucked up. These goggles were painted black and then there was just a tiny line scratched out so that you could only read the exact line that you're working on. So your eyes wouldn't wander. Oh, no, nah, that's fucked up. That's fucked up. <laughs> nah, that's fucked up. Nah, I can't, I can't. Nah, that's the fucked up. The had like we'll cushions so it would yeah. cancel out all of the noise. And then finally, what was kind of funny was uh, at first the design didn't have a hole for breathing. So people uh -huh. who would try it would get dizzy after 15 minutes. Oh my God. To fix that problem. And he stuck a, a tube into the, the face of it and connected an oxygen shank so people could work for hours on end. You know what's the thing? Somebody's going to reinvent this still. Like, you don't think it's going to get reinvented. Somebody is going to re reinvent this shit. Well, yeah. I mean, I wonder what it would look like today. You know, like, but does it seem like it makes sense? Like, do you need that much? Like, when. No, I the new isolator is going to be like a headband. Say it's a headband. I had been now. Now it looks cooler, right? Yeah. Now, now it's not. Cool. Now it's something people you can fuck with. That was a headband, right? Because you know what? All these people, they, they already got these sleep visors. So yo, that's what I'm saying. These things, this thing could come back. So my only thing is that I'm a little fucker and I get distracted easily. I'm probably mm -hmm. if I have a line, if I you give me a sliver, I am gonna right. look for an opportunity. Mm. Like I'm gonna be trying. That's the thing. Like. I mean, I think Adderall is what we invented. Uh, <laughs> I think. I think Adderall replaced the isolator, right? Yeah, that's I think true. that's what happened. They were like, we got the drug for that. <laughs> we got the drug. We got the drug, the isolator, the Ritalin. We, that will just, I'll be distracted to yeah. even have that on. Yeah. But I know if you're wearing that, I wouldn't distract you. I know that's exactly. for damn sure. Cause I wouldn't come near you. I wouldn't even talk to you. That's the thing, though. Well, what like the nobody house wants is to talk. Fucking burning down. Mm. You're like you can't hear it. You can't smell it. All of a sudden, your head starts getting hot. You could miss. You could be so focused. Next thing you know, you you could miss the the the, the countdown, New Year's countdown. You could yeah. miss a lot of shit that's going on around you, and you gotta exactly. be attentive to that. That shit looks like it closes your third eye. Yeah, that's probably like a thing. <laughs> 
we can all agree that these inventions are fucked are up. Fucked up. But not it's in a bad up. way. Not in a bad way. In a like a oh wow, I can't believe this guy thought of this almost a hundred kind of years ago kind of fucked up. You know, That's especially cool. that last one. That one was pretty fucked up. <laughs> that was fucked up. That was fucked up. <laughs> There may be an invention that is the most fucked up that someone out there hasn't invented yet. So to our viewers, if you have that invention, fucking make it. Fucking make it. And patent that shit too. Patent that shit. All right, well, thank you for joining us on How Fucked Up Is Fucked Up. How Fucked Up. How Fucked Up Is Fucked Up. It's fucked up.